Hello and welcome to the art studio. For today's drawing we are going to have a look at the human figure. I've decided to do figure drawing because we've completed a couple of portraits already and it seems like a natural progression to move on to the full figure. The best way to approach the human figure is to find somebody to model for you. Um, you know, if you can do this, it will give you a great chance to study the figure in the round, to look at shape and proportion and so on. And, you know, the great thing about having an actual model is that you can manage that person. You can ask them to sit in different positions. Uh, you can change the lighting. You can sit further away or closer to the figure. And so you can manage it to suit your preferences. However, for today's drawing, I've decided that we're going to use a photograph. Photographs are readily available, obviously. You can have a look on the internet, you can print out a photograph. But for today's drawing, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a fashion catalogue and I'm going to look through it and I'm just going to select out a figure that we can work from. So before we get started on the drawing for today, I've just picked out a few examples of figure drawings that I have done already from a catalogue. And so uh, you can see with these drawings here, I've just concentrated mainly on line. I've added a little bit of shading to it, but um, the main purpose of this drawing is just to try and get the, sh the proportion of the figure, uh, to get the angles of the arms and the legs and so on and just to try and make a good, simple, observational drawing from the photograph. This picture here takes it a little bit further, adding a wee bit of colour, and so I've tried to just really focus on the dress, and left the rest of the figure as mainly a line drawing, but I put a little suggestion of shading onto the legs and onto the arms and so on, and sometimes what I quite like to do is to break the figure up a wee bit and make it a little bit more stylized. This figure here is, uh, takes that one step further and so I've deliberately left out some areas and uh, just focused on a simple broad shading done with the side of the pencil and a bold sort of outline to it. I'm just trying to make it again a bit more abstract rather than just straightforward realistic. Uh, finally, this is the kind of drawing that I'm thinking we might have a go at today. It takes that again a stage further, adding a wee bit of colour to it. The shapes are all broken up and you can see I'm not concerned with sort of realism here. I'm trying to create an interesting, expressive and sort of creative figure drawing.
At this point I decided to come back to the drawing and to do a little bit more to it the following day. I decided that it was a little bit too rough and that I could improve the drawing if I just smoothed down the shading a wee bit more. Um, try to retain some of the white areas but to simplify the design and to make it look a little bit more finished. Thank you.